not so long ago, one of the videos on our channel received a comment saying that diamond-shaped UFOs are not really such. And this is the result of the work of the petals of the camera lenses, when the object is not in focus. We are objective people and decided to conduct an experiment. But before you start watching, do not forget to subscribe and like. So, the first video we shoot the moon and gradually increase the approximation. Panasonic V130 camera with optical zoom 75. As we can observe, no rhomboid distortion on the moon we do not see. We intentionally move the camera so as not to focus. We do it for the purity of the experiment. The only distortion is the rays from the moon when reduced. Do you think we will stop on this experiment? Of course not. We search for videos from this winter, when the moon was big enough, and watched the zoom process. Diamond is present when the camera is out of focus and not at maximum focal length. However, we want to note that the edges of the faces of a round object, the moon in this case, have rounded edges, and not a single hint of any movement of shape inside a defocused object. With increasing focal length, sharpness is induced. Now let's look at the diamond-shaped UFO, which managed to shoot this camera. We can observe sharper edges and a clearer shape inside. Many attempts were made to focus. Now compare the rhombus from the moon and the rhombus from the UFO. Focus defects or different objects. One thing can be started with certainty. The recorded UFOs are unidentified flying objects, and this cannot be denied. Thank you all for watching, leave your comments and don't forget to subscribe.